If you had $100 million to spare, would you buy a California estate with a full-sized basketball court? Or your very own trio of private islands? Maybe you'd rather buy yourself an entire resort. Or you could always decide to live in one of the world's most expensive penthouses. If all else fails, you can just hop aboard your super yacht and enjoy life at sea. Not every country or city offers homes that are this expensive, but the ones that do feature luxuries beyond your wildest dreams. This is what $100 million will get you all around the world. Le Penthouse is one of New York's most luxurious penthouses. And that's saying something, since the city is known for its opulent and often unaffordable accommodations. Just a block away from the Empire State Building, this five-story condo in Midtown Manhattan will cost you $98 million. It comes with 19,000 square feet of interior space and ceilings up to 23 feet high. There are 11 bedrooms and 14 bathrooms, not to mention 4,500 square feet of outdoor space. There's a wraparound private deck, a pool, and a hot tub. The building comes with lots of things to make living easy. There's a full-time doorman, a lap pool, a spa and gym, and even a lounge with billiards tables. But keep in mind that the $98 million price tag doesn't include a single piece of furniture or appliances. So this penthouse will just get pricier. Head over to the United Kingdom and $100 million will have you living right next door to the Queen. Seriously, you can step out onto your balcony and wave at her from across the street. This 15,000 square foot 19th century mansion borders Buckingham Palace and costs 76 million pounds or about 105 million US dollars. It's a seven floor home with six bedrooms and 10 bathrooms plus five reception rooms. It also comes with accommodations for staff. A six person elevator will take you to all floors so you can visit this spacious library or perhaps the private spa area with a 10-meter swimming pool, sauna, gym, and bar. The home also comes with a private garage. And if you're iffy about spending nine figures on the place, you could always rent it for 47,000 pounds or 65,000 US dollars per week. The $100 million Unica Estate in Bel Air, California is a mansion like no other. It's perched atop a canyon with unobstructed California views and spans over 40,000 square feet. It offers the perfect indoor-outdoor living experience, as well as plenty of entertainment options. There's an NBA-sized basketball court that can be transformed into a ballroom, an illuminated auto gallery with room for 20 vehicles, and six different bars. Of course, we can't forget the two-story, 1,000-bottle, temperature-controlled wine cellar. Catch a movie in the 36-seat state-of-the-art home theater with a popcorn and candy bar, or enjoy the wellness floor with its salt water lap pool and stone steam room. There's a gym with mirrored walls and luxurious suites on the top floor. Last but not least, the outdoor lounge area is phenomenal. There's a multi-level patio space and an infinity edge pool. However, this home is so expensive, they're actually having trouble selling it. In 2020, it received a price cut and was relisted for $78 million. Why buy one private island when you could just get three? The Caonetis Islands in Panama are an untouched paradise, and all three are on sale for $100 million. The trio of islands, Bayonetta, Cañas, and La Caida, are in Las Perlas Archipelago, about 30 minutes by helicopter from Panama City. They have more than 50 beaches, 19 miles of coastline, and a total of 1,800 acres of land. And they're packed with exotic wildlife. But they come with a catch. Only 30% of the islands can undergo eco-conscious development. The rest has to be kept as a nature preserve. If that's cool with you, well then they're the perfect place to build an eco-friendly vacation destination. St. Tropez, France has some amazing villas, and you could buy three of them on an ultra-private plot of land for $100 million. The deal is for two large villas plus a third that's still under construction at the time of this video. Each one has four ensuite bedrooms, a fireplace, and a gym. The main house also has a cinema lounge in the basement. There are 21 bathrooms across all three properties, and each villa has its own black marble swimming pool. The entire plot of land is surrounded by nature with breathtaking views of the sea. Are you interested in one of the world's most expensive private islands? Located between Granada, Tobago, St. Vincent, and Barbados. For exactly $100 million, the island features 2,000 acres of land ideal for setting up a resort or a vacation home. 
It currently has relaxing tropical facilities, but no modern amenities, so it's in need of a billionaire investor to give it some luxury upgrades. The island has tons of beaches, wildlife, and even quartz-covered caves that you can swim through. There are crystal clear waters with up to 100 feet of visibility. But the best part is that it's one of the few places on Earth not controlled by a government or nation, making it one of the only completely private properties that you can own. This is Australia's most expensive penthouse. It's sold while under development for 140 million Australian dollars or about 104 million US dollars. It's part of One Sydney Harbour, a high-end real estate development project across three buildings. The project's luxury units have made more than $1 billion from sales and commitments. This penthouse is located in the 72-story Tower One and includes a two-level main penthouse and a sub-penthouse apartment taking up the building's top three floors. There are nine bedrooms across the more than 17,000 square feet of living space. There's a spa and a gym in the unit, plus unbeatable views of the Sydney Harbour thanks to these massive floor-to-ceiling windows. For $100 million, you can buy three of the most expensive residences on the lavish, man-made Palm Jumeirah Island in Dubai. The most expensive home currently on sale there is this $49 million five-bedroom, five-bathroom penthouse with a private pool. It's located in the Atlantis Royal Residences, which features a stunning infinity pool and an exquisite sky lounge. You can also buy yourself a mansion nearby for when you want extra privacy. This glamorous home costs $31 million and comes with six bedrooms and eight bathrooms. It's four floors in total with a rooftop terrace, an auto vault in the basement, and a sprawling outdoor space with a pool. You can top off your Dubai real estate investment with this $22 million apartment. Located on the two highest floors of the 22-carat Villa Clubhouse, it features beachfront views and an outdoor pool. There are five bedrooms and eight bathrooms in total, plus a cozy home cinema. In some places, $100 million is enough to buy an epic luxury resort, like Andaz Turks and Kaikos at Grace Bay. Its facilities include an indoor-outdoor spa, a fitness studio, and yoga pavilion, and places to play tennis and enjoy water sports like a relaxing day spent sailing. Once construction is completed, there will be three restaurants and three bars, plus pools overlooking Grace Bay Beach. In total, there will be 59 hotel suites and 74 residences across the 5.5-acre property. It'll have everything from studios to villas, priced from $475,000 to $8.5 million each. Not a fan of settling down? Then maybe you don't need a nine-figure home. Instead, you can enjoy this $100 million yacht. The Summer Yacht was built in the UK, but you can take it anywhere. Its 77 meters are about 252 feet long and can accommodate up to 18 guests in seven luxurious cabins. You'll have everything you ever need on board, from a pool and a gym to a cinema and several different bars. There's also a tender garage where you can keep all of your extra boats and toys. Did you know that London had the most high-end home sales in the world in 2020? There were 201 residential sales above $10 million in the city. These sales were worth $3.7 billion in total. As of 2020, there are at least 20 homes worth over $100 million in the city's richest neighborhoods. Thanks for watching. See you next time.